WGN's Brona Tomoti is live with our top story. Brona. Good evening, guys. Yeah, more than 40 people shot, including three teenagers and a two-year-old, since about 5 o'clock on Friday evening. And of those people shot, we know that at least nine people have passed away. In the midst of all of that, the mayor showing his support today for Chicago police by joining a roll call on the southwest side. To have you here, Mr. Mayor, uh, speaks volumes. We know you have a lot on your plate, and you could be doing many other things right now. Thank you. Mayor Brandon Johnson standing with the officers of the 8th District today in a show of solidarity. We have a big task as a city to bring us all together. But we are the freaking city of Chicago. There's not a task too big that we cannot handle. He emphasized the importance of working together for the sake of the city during open roll call at Wentworth Park on the southwest side. I come from a very large family. I'm one of ten. And I know that if you point fingers at one another, nothing gets done. There's a lot more we can accomplish together than pointing at one another. But the holiday weekend and the unofficial start to summer kicked off with shots fired at North Avenue Beach on Friday. And there have been more than 40 people shot around Chicago over the last 48 hours. I got to bed at 4.45 Saturday morning and uh, and then there was a shooting at 5 o'clock. Street pastor Donovan Price doing his best over the last couple of days and nights to comfort victims when and where he can. So much is being done or so much is being attempted mm -hmm. um, to curtail this type of, this level of violence, but unfortunately it's uh, it's been a bloody, deadly weekend. Telling us the new mayor has taken over at a tough time, but says anything that can be done to save even a single life is worth it. If you could change one life or cause one life to continue, one child to make it um, as they get out of school, to make it back to school in, in August, then you've done you know, a great deal of, uh, uh, of uh, health for the city. Now, statistics relating to shootings are updated weekly by Chicago Police. They're updated on Mondays. This week, it'll be Tuesday due to the holiday. The most recent numbers we have are from last Monday, and that shows year-to-date at least 814 shootings around the city. Obviously, that has gone up since then, but it's actually 9% lower than last year when there were 890 shootings in the same period. We're live at CPT headquarters, Bruno Tumulty. WGN News.